Hello everybody, it's your girl Connie Kenneth and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Welcome to the Connie gang, welcome to the family. This is a place, this is the place to be. Listen, if you're not subscribed, please make sure you subscribe because most of you are watching my videos, but you're not subscribed and help me reach 1000 subscribers. Okay, so um, I'm going to react to a very um, uh, special video today. Uh, it's from Ama Gavana. And so uh, a very beautiful young woman, as you can see from Ghana, and uh, she's going to ask Americana in a trotro. So that's a social experiment. So I'm not sure if a trotro is a tuk-tuk, like we call them in you know, Kenya, like the three wheel, um, you know, um, how you say, public transport kind of car. So let's see the video uh, and make sure you share if you enjoy my reaction video. I like it raw. I haven't watched it, so I don't know what's awaiting me. So let's see, and uh, yeah, let's go. What is up? It's your girl, Ama Gavana. Ama Gavana. Okay, hi, Ama. Nice to meet you. Uh, back again with another video. <laughs> Yeah, but I can already tell from um, the way she's dressed that it's, this will be a little bit provocative, especially in an African setting. You know, you must dress properly in public. Um, and yeah, so I guess she will get um, weird reactions, probably aggression. I don't know. Uh, this is a very daring video, I would say. Uh, but yeah, let's see how this social experience goes. And you guys already, well, you didn't request that, so I just said it to you and you guys were so down for it. So yes, we're, we're doing it for the So you guys, uh, today we're going to... The nails are done, the top is on point, the hair, the sunglasses, let's go. But I think this one will be so, um, I think it, it will be very funny. What we're doing is, we're going to be entering into church, or trying to take like a shot, right? And then just getting people to like react to the way I dress. It's going to be funny. Makeup and I look boom, so that's the way to go. I love it. I love the energy already, but I don't know what you guys think. But I feel Ghanaians have a very nice vibe, great energy. I'm just thinking about Stella Chanel every time I watch her videos. I'm always smiling, I'm in a good mood because she is, and looks like I'm a governor is in the same vibe, you know. So, ah, oh, I love it. Okay, and you guys have a problem with my accent. When I try to do an accent, listen, okay, it does, I, I would switch, but it doesn't matter how you don't even notice. So, again, like I said, the point is. <laughs> But I feel, I'm sorry, I just keep posing, but I love this already. But I feel that if a person like says something and then maybe in your local language and then you understand it, you might just like fall out of character because you will be shocked maybe by the remark. You know, you might lose your accent. So if there is a remark or, you know, something, you might be like very, um, just fall out of character because it will be unexpected. So that's my take. I think that's how it's going to go down. Are already staring at me as fuck. Like I look fucking, mm. fucking stupid, but it's gonna be hard. You guys, look, I know I've been weird, jewelry, but look, your girl is doing it, but you don't even pay. Exciting boy, come on me. I said, girl. Oh, she's looking good, but my girl, I'm telling you, I admire your courage right now, <laughs> especially. In Africa, I admire your courage right now because this this is something that will most definitely shock so many people. They will be surprised. They will be, you know, you there will be like a whole mix of reactions. And I remember growing up um, in, in Kenya, actually, and where I come from, I know I have souvenirs of girls who are actually ripped 
their clothes off. Why? Because they were they were wearing some short, some short shorts or a skirt or um, you know where you could see the cleavage and stuff like that. And um and they had their clothes ripped off by um you know by the troll troll guys and. It's terrible because, you know, you feel like you're not free to do whatever you want. Uh, so that's why I'm telling you you're courageous and this is so daring. And just for your fans, your supporters, you love your supporters. <laughs> you guys, you guys, you guys, are you feeling my outfit? Are you feeling, you think that we're going to get the reaction? <laughs> oh, they're already watching. Look at that. <laughs> He is already peeping, but yeah, I mean, I mean, I understand. <laughs> Do you think we're about to get a good reaction? Also, I'm going to be shouting in the draw, so I'm going to see anything I can to get a good reaction. Let's fucking go. <laughs> So brave let me know for me I feel like this social experiment even without seeing what's going to go on after this one is already um, a success it's already says we as viewers already we're just like in oh and thinking like girl you're so crazy uh, to do such a thing but I feel like you're in good company and in that case yeah it makes sense because you can be aggressed so easily by people who are appalled or you know because yeah i mean that's how it is hey guys so right now i'm standing by the roadside and it's as if i'm like waiting for a troll troll so i think i'm going to my story is going to be that i just like came back and i'm mm -hmm. um, taking a troll troll because i've heard so much about it and so hi oh someone just said oh my god that's so cute anyway um oh she's so pretty i think we should have taken that one huh. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, I'm wasting time. Let me. Oh, guys, I just stopped one. I just stopped one. I just stopped talking. Oh. What happened? What happened? Because one just arrived. Okay, let me. Oh, guys, I just stopped one. I just stopped one. I just stopped talking. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Okay. <laughs> dead ass. Dead ass. Oh my goodness. That is so embarrassing. That is so embarrassing. And you know, so first of all, Trotro, so it's not a tuk tuk. So it's a matatu. That's how we call them in Kenya. It's a matatu. And I'm like, these guys, if, even if there is no space, you will take the conductor's space, okay? Seat. And I thought they just left. They were like, no, no, none of that. We don't want that. So, girl, I'm so embarrassed for you right now. It's terrible. My goodness. I'm not even capping. They literally just left me. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Okay, okay. Oh, my God. Another one. Another one that's coming, you guys. This is so oh, fucking no. funny. Oh. Yeah, it's a bargain. Okay, let's hurry up, let's hurry up. Oh my God. And number two, like, they're not stopping. That's crazy. <laughs> you guys, you're not even picking me because I literally... Hey, look at, look at the man there. He's just peeping. Stop one and he did not pick me. <laughs> Even one of the gentlemen, you know, in the background. But I feel it's like a mixed reaction. That him, he's older, and he's, he might be, like, in shock. And the guy, the other one, is like, okay. But, I mean, this, this is hilarious. I love it. I love it. But, yeah, you should enjoy the African beauty. Let's go. <laughs> wow. I'm, I'm even annoyed. <laughs> Yes, I know, but girls, stop cursing because YouTube doesn't like that. They might just pick a video and just uh, demonetize it if you're monetized already. So stop cursing in your videos. You never know. Fuck. Okay, Alma, let's stop. Did you stop this one or did your cousin stop this one? Let me know. Let me know. Oh my 
called the tro tro you know you got in the you know you were in the what do you call it you know you got in the game to you know immediately i'm just, you even making me speak french you know um yeah so you're just in the game and you're like let's get this let's change the accent let's be loud and yeah so okay so let the prank i don't know or the social experiment begin uh, um in the tro tro Oh my god, I actually know your name. You're called Mate, right? Oh my god, this is so cute! So how do you know his name? How? Let me know. Okay, everyone. I feel like it's kind of dark, but we can make it, maybe make it work. Uh, okay, on one, two, three, everyone is going to say hi. Okay, you guys? <laughs> Girl. <laughs> Oh my goodness. My take is, first of all, they're like, who is this crazy woman coming into the bus, screaming, shouting, dressed like, you know, like she's just crazy, like, like naked, the way we would say the African setting. Um, and, and you're asking them to, to say hi. No way. My bet is they will not say, um, uh, <laughs> They will not say hi. That's my take. Okay. One, two, three. Everyone is going to say hi. Okay, you guys? Okay. <laughs> Yo, did you see the guy? Just look at the guy with the with the earphones on, right? Just look at how he just... Just check that. Gonna say hi. Okay, you guys? <laughs> He's like, yeah, right. Okay. <laughs> he should be a meme. He should be a meme for a fact. He should be a meme. Like, what the... What? What? Girl. Crickets, right? I thought so. making fun of the accent like with everybody you know so oh it's, but it's cute it's cute. thank you oh my god you guys people in Ghana are so nice uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh poor kids poor kids Crazy. <laughs> want to go to America? Oh, okay, so like, do you don't want her to be your sponsor or something? Oh! <laughs> she forgot her accent. Oh, wow. What's it? Hello, ma. Okay, you're not going to go to the bathroom. Yeah. I guess we're going to Estate Junction. Estate Junction. Uh-huh, yeah. Is that what it's yeah. called? Yeah, I think Estate Junction. It's not Estate Junction. Oh, is it? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Ah, okay, okay. I feel you, I feel you. Okay, that's what's up. Shout out, shout out. <laughs> so I, I think the guy just 
look is like okay she's got the um, the Ghanaian cities I guess it's like she's you're not American or something you know I don't have my dollars but this would work right okay so how much is it from here to there ah I don't even know how much that is like I don't know what the fuck that is but Ah, I don't even know how much that is. Like, I don't know what the fuck that is, but yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. I love how confident you are. It just makes you so beautiful. I love it. Wow, you're so strong. Look at how he pulled the the. the. <laughs> But he's so strong. Uh, wow. That is absolutely insane. Go, 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 go. Me, I say you're really strong. Oh, that's really strong. You're welcome. <laughs> so macho. No, not you like seducing the guy. <laughs> But one thing is for sure, Ama, you've made these people say they will remember you for at least a week and they will tell their friends, they will talk about it for a long time. So this is crazy. So. try and calculate that. Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh my god. Oh wow. Thank you. you're like what what am i doing right now what are people thinking about me you're like oh, i think at that point those few seconds right there Amma must be wondering like what am i doing like you must like i think you just went back to your normal self and you're like i am crazy you know let me know if i'm right <laughs> And the girl and the ladies are pulled like, damn, you know. Hey guys, so I know. I Wait, what happened? Hey. Oh, I thought there was going to be like a second part in a trotro again. Oh no, what happened? Oh no, I was really looking forward to the next trotro, you know, but let's see. Hey guys, so I know I wasn't able to finish that video. Mm. I want to just come on here and explain quickly why I was unable to finish that video and some of the challenges that I faced. Mm -hmm. And also to let you guys know that in spite of these challenges, I would 100% go back out there and create a part two, a lengthier mm -hmm. part two of this very video idea to entertain you guys mm -hmm. if you guys feel strongly about this video and you feel like 
you would really be entertained by this video. I would 100% go out there and do it. Yes, but do not risk your life, okay? Do not risk your life for entertainment purposes. It made me, it just made my day, okay? So I would say yes to a part two, but only and only if um, you, you don't put your life in danger because you never know out there, it's crazy. But essentially what had happened was it was around 3 p.m. and there were, a lot of the buses were not filled. A lot of the short shows were not filled at all. And even when they were filled, they were filled with Gen Zers or people who seem like Gen Zers. So not people who would have a problem with the way that I was dressed. Okay, so what's that? What's in Gen Z? What's that? Let me know in the comment section below what that means. Um, or the way that I was just acting in general. So we weren't getting good reactions. I would actually filmed quite a bit and it wasn't anything to write home about so that's why I didn't and also I did suffer a lot of anxiety during that video I'm not even going to lie to you guys but like I said I would still go out and do it most of the videos yeah, I do I saw it just um just uh I said it in this video I could tell at some point you were really stressed out and you didn't really know you were uncomfortable at some point and uh, we could tell by the way you were not talking you're just observing around you felt like you just came out of your body and you're like girl what are you doing right now so i understand but because it was your first video i believe that's the reason why uh it was just the beginning so i guess if you do a few more you'll be more comfortable but make sure you have bodyguards with you you know your brothers your cousins uh your friends i don't know but uh, make sure you have men around you to uh to protect you just in case anyway i suffer a lot of anxiety mm -hmm. um but really the anxiety is repaired it's not long-term damaging um in my experience so far and it is one where i get healed instantly by you guys' feedback on the video that's if you guys like it like for instance the prank i did to laura k insane anxiety but when i finished filming it i loved it so much and then i loved it even more when you guys gave me the great feedback so like i'm saying i'm uh, don't worry about it i would 100 percent do it just let me know if you really think that you know i should because i i i inquired for my cousin and he felt strongly that the place that we had gone to pick out for the video was not the most ideal place at the time especially was not the most ideal time for the type of video that i wanted and in particular the type of reactions that I wanted mm -hmm. and that we should either go very early in the morning or very late but we can't go very late obviously because am I talking too fast apologies mm -hmm. but I have some work mm -hmm. that I have to do I have to submit a legal opinion really soon so that's why I'm trying to just do this and then go back to oh you're doing low studies did I hear that right opinion really soon so wait in the morning or very late but we can't go very late obviously because am I talking too fast apologies but I have some work that I have to do. I have to submit a legal opinion really soon. So, okay, I heard legal opinion. Okay, so guess you're doing law studies, but good job. That's why I'm trying to just do this and then go back to law. Okay. <laughs> but yes, um, what was I saying? <laughs> I forgot what I was saying, but yes, I'm sure you guys get the gist of what I was trying to say. So let me know. Let me know in the comments down below. I want you guys to all comment each comment i want to see a lot of comments okay to convince me to go back out there because if i tell you it wasn't easy it was not easy at yeah. all okay yeah and i believe you 100 percent. that's why i i think you're very courageous brave because um that's a tricky video to make um you know uh in ghana in africa as a whole it's a very tricky video so i understand you 100 percent Anyway, don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I hope you enjoyed the one encounter that did, in fact, happen. Yeah. And um, that was kind of funny. But also, I think I want to just quickly say that mm. the mates did not steal the money. I just thought to leave that part to leave that part in because I felt like it was it was funny. But when I got off the bus, he explained to me that he was under the impression that I was paying for me and my cousin. You know, even okay. though was, my cousin wasn't supposed to seem to them to be with me okay. he assumed that we were together because we took the bus at the same place and okay. um so he had deducted his fare from it so i don't want you guys to have his face in mind and have attached to that face that you oh. have in mind that this person is a dishonest person no no yeah yeah no i personally i thought that he uh he was looking for the dollars and then when you 
got the Ghanaian cities, I think you say, um, then he was like, okay, so, yeah, and I would be so curious to know how you know his name, and did he at some point say like, oh, but I think I know you, did you tell him that you were pranking him as well, that it was just a social experiment, I, it would have been so nice to see their reactions once you've told them, just to know what was their mindset at that point, like, did I think that this girl is crazy, did they, what, what did I think about you, it would have been really nice, and I think in the future, maybe that's the only thing I would say, would be once you've done it, go back and see those people and ask them uh, their, their reaction, uh, what was their first impression of you, and uh, and how did they, how did they take you for a mad person, for an easy girl, for a, a, an actual American, Americana woman? So yeah, it would have been really nice to see uh, what their first impression of you. No, no. Okay, it was just a mistake, but I included that part in for humor, obviously, and for entertainment because I didn't get enough, but I really felt uh, strongly that I should come out here and explain to you guys that he is not a dis dishonest person. He wasn't trying to steal my money or cheat me in any way, okay? Great. Okay. And like I was saying, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye! <laughs> yeah, girl, thank you so much. Don't forget to like, yeah, thank you so much. Thank you so, 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 so much. That video is hilarious. I loved it. I love it. I hope there'll be a part two. But like I said, I hope you'll be in a safe place. Do not put yourself in danger for, you know, for your subscribers. But also, it would be nice to see their reaction after you've left the torture. Just go back and tell them, hey, it was this. What did you think about me? And things like that. Just to see um, what they, I mean, their opinion. Okay, so... Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. My cheeks are hurting right now again. I, I was just smiling throughout because um, it was a fantastic video. So thank you so much for watching. And until next time, make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell another friend. Okay, until next time, bye.